Lisa Rinna just spilled the beans on Kyle Richards and Mauricio Umansky's split. Get ready for a revelation that's shaking up Hollywood's favorite couple. Kyle Richards, known for her roles in the Halloween movies, and Mauricio Umansky, the charming realtor from The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, were the ultimate power couple of the RHOBH scene. Since the show starred in 2010, they stood out as a beacon of stability amid a storm of failed relationships, broken friendships, family disputes and heartaches that plague their fellow cast members. Kyle, a successful entrepreneur and loving mother to four daughters, held her family close to her heart. The mere thought of her children leaving home was enough to bring her to tears. Meanwhile, Mauricio was the go-to real estate mogul, building his empire with offices spanning the globe. While drama unfolded around them over the past 12 years, the Umanskis remained a steady presence, providing viewers with a sense of comfort amidst all the chaos. Their love story and bond made them the envy of Beverly Hills and the heart of the real housewives of Beverly Hills. So the news hit like a tidal wave. After 27 years of marriage, Kyle Richards and Mauricio Umansky, the beloved power couple of the RHOBH, were calling it quits. Fans were left in utter disbelief. How could this unshakable duo crumble? Rumors swirled, and some even speculated whether the infamous vaping psychic Alison Dubois had been right all along in her predictions about Mauricio not fulfilling Kyle emotionally. To add fuel to the fire, tabloids went wild with headlines claiming Kyle was in a same-sex relationship with country singer Morgan Wade. Yes, you heard that right. Kyle leaving Mauricio for a woman. This revelation was as shocking as Lisa Rinna deciding to change her husband's name from Harry Hamlin to just Harry. While Kyle had faced her fair share of challenges, including navigating her sister Kim's struggles with alcoholism and dealing with ongoing issues with her sister Kathy, nobody had expected Kyle to explore relationships with women. But just when everyone thought they had the story straight, Kyle and Mauricio threw another curveball. They took to Instagram, happily posing together with their daughters, insisting that their fairy tale marriage was still intact. Well, sort of. The drama continued leaving fans on the edge of their seats, eagerly waiting to see how this Beverly Hills saga would unfold. Their official statement on the recent news left many scratching their heads. It declared, Regarding the reports about our marriage, we want to clarify that we're not getting a divorce, and there has been no wrongdoing by either of us. However, it's been a challenging year. Instead of offering clarity, this statement raised more questions. Are they still sharing the same roof? Or is Kyle living in the infamous goddamn house that her sister Kim once claimed she stole? And what does a rough year actually entail? It couldn't be something as trivial as Mauricio not tidying up or taking forever to put on a decent suit before guests arrive, right? It had to be something more significant. Something amazing, as Mauricio would put it. Despite their curiosity swirling around them, the couple chose not to reveal more details, deepening the mystery surrounding the Umanskis. The rumors about a possible romance between Kyle Richards and Wade Morgan went into overdrive when Morgan released the music video for her song, Fall in Love With Me. The video featured Richards as a sultry character, seemingly smitten with her new next-door neighbor, Morgan, and ended in a sensual embrace. Soon after, Wei tried to clarify the situation, publicly stating that they were just friends. Richards echoed this just friends stance, despite the fact that both women now sport matching tattoos. About two months ago, while caught on camera in West Hollywood, Kyle emphatically answered yes when asked if her rumored romance with Morgan was just a rumor. But the plot thickened less than two weeks ago, when paparazzi captured the pair enjoying a friendly shopping spree in Paris. Page Six also reported that an insider spotted Richards and Morgan at a cafe in the City of Lights, where there was a lot of playful touching between them. On the other side of the Atlantic Ocean, Mauricio Umansky is facing his own set of challenges. The future of his reality series, Buying Beverly Hills, remains uncertain. While Netflix announced its renewal in 2023, they haven't revealed the air date. This delay may be linked to Umansky's more pressing issue, a whopping $35 million lawsuit tied to a potentially shady deal involving the sale of a Malibu mansion. 
This lawsuit is no simple matter. It's entangled with international intrigue, accusations of corrupt foreign governments, money laundering, and an alleged plan to buy a lavish estate at a low price, flip it, and make a substantial profit. According to Raider Online, Umansky has recently sought to have the lawsuit dismissed, arguing that the statute of limitations has expired because the deal in question dates back to 2014. If a $35 million judgment goes against Umansky, it could jeopardize the future of his luxury real estate firm, The Agency, and those annual Umansky backyard white parties with fat burger pop-ups. Mauricio Umansky's recent legal issues might explain his surprising appearance as a contestant on this season's Dancing with the Stars. Perhaps dancing on national TV is his way to manage legal bills. However, it raises questions about whether potential clients would want to sign deals with a real estate company led by someone doing the cha-cha in a bright yellow bedazzled jumpsuit every week. ABC clearly sees potential in Umansky for ratings, seizing the opportunity to feature tabloid headlines about his marital struggles during the show's September 26th premiere. Umansky immediately delivered a rehearsed statement, mentioning his rough year with wife Kyle Richards and expressing hope that Dancing with the Stars would provide a distraction. Interestingly, Kyle and their family attended the show, appearing supportive and proud, perhaps to counter the rumors about their troubled marriage. TMZ reported Dancing with the Stars had approached both Kyle and her friend Morgan to join the cast, although both declined. Kyle, however, seemed to have opted for a different strategy, attending the tapings to quash the marriage rumors. Given Umansky's less than impressive scores from the judges, receiving only fives after his first dance, it remains to be seen how long Kyle and the kids will continue their studio visits. The next of RHOBH is shaping up to be a must-watch, as the once idyllic Umansky household goes through significant changes. Ever since Lisa Vanderpump left the show in 2019, Kyle has taken on the role of being the de facto leader of the glamorous ladies in this exclusive zip code. In the previous season, Kyle provided a sense of stability as Erica grappled with sobriety and her own marital tales. Crystal Minkoff worked through her eating disorder, and Dorit Kemsley coped with the trauma of a home invasion. Kyle was like the unshakable anchor, firmly grounded amidst all the drama. The upcoming 13th season, set to air in November, is expected to revolve around Kyle and her personal revelations. With Denise Richards making a return, despite not being so close to Kyle, and given the past gossip about her alleged involvement with former Housewives cast member Brandi Glanville in the 10th season, it's a safe bet that Denise will be eager to put Kyle in the hot seat and turn up the heat. While RHOBH has had its share of drama over the last 12 years, the forthcoming season promises to be one of the most explosive yet, especially now that the picture-perfect world of Kyle and Mauricio has come undone. Currently, no RHOBH star has offered a viable explanation for the split of Kyle and Mauricio. Erica Jane is keeping shush about Kyle and Mauricio's rumored breakup. In a recent interview, the pop star was asked about the elephant in the room, referring to her real Housewives of Beverly Hills co-stars reported split from their real estate agent after 30 years of marriage. However, Jane chose not to spill any details. They're not, said the Chicago actress, dismissing separation rumors. She added, I let Kyle explain, but they're not splitting. They've been through a tough time. They've admitted that. I believe it's best for her to tell her own story throughout the season. Jane, still entangled in her own divorce and legal challenges with estranged husband Tom Girardi, shared her perspective noting that during her own difficulties, there were many uninformed voices speaking out. Meanwhile, during an appearance in Watch What Happens Live, fellow RHOBH cast member Garcelle Beauvais didn't hold back when asked if Richards and Umansky's marriage was a topic of conversation during season 13. Yes, for sure, replied the model, mentioning that both she and Sutton Strack were suspicious about the state of Richards and Umansky's relationship. Should Kyle open up about her relationship struggles with Mauricio on the show? Or should they keep the details of their separation private? Let us know in the comments. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for all the Hollywood tea and drama. If there's juice to be had, you can count on Miss Juice to bring it to you.